Hey y'all, welcome to the yurt. So we are here in Marble Falls, Texas, and we are going to be reviewing this King Yurt and the rest of the property as well. The Retreat Ranch is a family owned business located on 46 acres out here in the Hill Country, Texas. So we were invited out by the owner, Shannon, who has been hosting events for almost 10 years. She designed this property to be a peaceful getaway, either in one of the unique glamping accommodations or in a hosted retreat event. So today, unfortunately, we are not on a retreat. However, I would love to come back to their women's yoga and wine retreat. But today we are actually getting to stay in one of the unique accommodations and we are in the King Yurt. So let's go check it out. Come on in to the King Yurt. Welcome to our 425 square foot canvas glamping tent. This is so well decorated. It is so boho, country, rustic. Every decoration looks like it fits perfectly in this space. So this tent doesn't look big from the outside, but once you enter, it opens up and it has space for everything you need. You have this beautiful king size bed, a lovely living space slash sitting area, and a miniature fridge for all of your desired beverages. And something that I just realized that was in here is complimentary robes. <laughs> Wow, look how beautiful and fluffy these are. I will say you probably will not need them for June, which is what, <laughs> when we're recording this right now. It's a little toasty, but oh my gosh. Imagine coming in winter or fall and getting to wrap up in one of these and have coffee on the porch. Oh, I love that so much, which is a good segue to this beautiful porch. So this stay comes with a private patio, perfect for your morning coffee or your evening glass of wine while you're engulfed in nature. Right behind me is a playground for the kiddos and a volleyball court. Apparently they just flattened this this year to build the volleyball court and the playground. But let's go check out these little buildings over here. It looks like a little mini town. Real quick, this is our bathroom They're directly behind our king gear. And as we continue, it looks like this is just a little glamping village. There's about three other glamping tents right here, one behind Jenna, one behind me, and then one over here to the left. But we wanna show you the main little village area. So let's go check it out. This is the common area. So we have our kitchen, we have our dining space. This is also where the Wi-Fi is. So Jen and I will probably be working in here until we go to bed, but it has everything you need. It's a fully equipped kitchen and you have a giant fridge, you have an ice maker, you also have a coffee maker, and there's also two bathrooms in here. So if you don't want to go to the bathroom outside, you can come to the indoor bathroom. And out here, it looks like a little town, a little mini town, but this has an amazing outdoor common area and a huge fire pit over here. It's basically like a com little community, which is perfect for retreats or getaways if you're looking to host a large number of people. Okay, so the next building we're about to show you is my absolute favorite, and I will show you it now. This is called the 1860 house, and it's called that because all of the materials, like the wood and the tin roof, have been taken from a home that was built in 1860 in the Dallas area and refurbished into this new building. About 60% of the retreat ranch is actually created from refurbished materials, so that is something that they pride themselves on, but let's go ahead and show you inside. <laughs> so this is a very zen, room. It's where I think most of the yoga and meditation classes are held. It is so incredibly peaceful and beautiful. Shannon decorated it all. She got all the props and the decorations from, I believe, like an antique sale, and it's really brought this space together. I'm thinking that we might have to come meditate here later. And this last building is the main building where you can check in, ask any of your questions, and shop around at their adorable boutique. So this is the hangout area, and it's actually made with retired A&M football field is what they said, which is very interesting. And they have two little kiddie pools, but they're for everybody. And you also have a hot tub in the back. Maybe we could swim later. Okay, they're finally here. The absolute best part about this property is that there's free range horses, and there's supposed to be a mini one, which I saw. Let's go, just go catch them. Here's the small one. Where'd the other one go? So as we were looking at the horses, Josh, who is the ranch hand around here, has decided that he is gonna show us around, which is perfect because we were gonna show you around, but very aimlessly, but he knows this place in and out. And he is gonna show us 
everywhere on this property, I'm sure. Yeah, he should be here any second to pick us up on his mule, so. We're waiting. Here. Gary, it right. has arrived, sir. <laughs> Thank you. We don't ride in fashion, but we ride. <laughs> I'll drive safe since they're guests. Yeah, please do. <laughs> <laughs> yes, please. Oh, this one used to be Voss's um, main trail lead horse. Rio, oh, we have wow. no treats. And now we got this dude later on, and now he's the boss. That's hey, why sweet. he come running up. <laughs> That's why he had to see Josh's hand because Pax did. I don't have no food. That's Mambo. They keep putting him on a diet. <laughs> Mambo. It ain't working. Like Eeyore. How you doing? Say hi. Hi, bud. This one's bud. Say hi, sweetie. He's very sweet. Big boy. Hi, mommy, 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 mommy. <laughs> they don't like me. <laughs> oh, uh, we'll get some treats and they'll love oh. you to death. <laughs> there is a ton of them. Yeah. No, no, the seat takes all the fun out of it. My boss is 200 pounds. You made it. <laughs> oh my gosh. You won't trip, I promise. You just let go and ride out. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! You did it! <laughs> it's a little scary, but it ain't bad. <laughs> Have you tried it? No. She I won't. was a little scared. She won't do it. Yeah, I don't blame you. <laughs> The rest of the tour from Josh and Robin was amazing. They both play an integral role in building out the ranch and maintaining the day-to-day -day operations. We were blown away by the work that they've put into these accommodations and their attention to detail. Wow, this is so cool. I know. It came with the USB. She's like, no, we need a table to set your phone on. I'm like, okay. Oh, that's genius. So we built a table to put your phone on. <laughs> that's actually funny. It is. <laughs> Okay, so that was so fun. They are such a nice couple. Yeah. And we really enjoyed getting that tour. But now we're gonna like hang out with the horses a bit and also go see the goats. <laughs> and these suckers are loud. Listen to him, listen to him. He's excited. Oh my goodness. They all are. Look. Look at him. <laughs> They're so cute. <laughs> Where's my food? Where's my food? Hey, aren't they so cute? I love you guys. Look at your floppy ears. Look at this ear. They're, I think, a bit disappointed that we didn't bring food. Sorry, guys. I, I love them. Can we bring them home? No, they just got here. Okay. So we just had a wonderful dinner in the Blue Bonnet Cafe in Marble Falls. There are so many restaurants nearby, but I chose that one because my Aunt Vicky absolutely loves that place. And I think it was the right decision because it was packed for a Tuesday night. But we had such good breakfast because they serve all day breakfast and a slice of pie. Anyway, now we're gonna get some work done. So we gotta do some stuff and we will see you in the morning. had the best sleep probably of our entire life <laughs> <laughs> we're actually off to a little bit of a late start because of it yeah the bed in the yurt is tempur-pedic which makes it so comfortable it was so dark and cozy in there yeah 
and, and cool. The AC worked perfectly. So overall, this has been such a wonderful experience. We've been so impressed with the Retreat Ranch and we'd love to come back when there is a retreat going on or event or maybe bring some family with us to stay in the other yurts. We wanna give a huge thanks to the owners, Nathan and Shannon, for inviting us out and allowing us to stay in the yurt and to experience this ranch. And we also wanna say thank you so much to Josh, Robin, and Megan, the staff here, for helping us out um, throughout these past two days. Yeah, everybody has just been so amazing. It's just been such a fun experience. This place is amazing. We could seriously sit here and talk about it for like probably like another hour or two. So anyways, we hope you enjoyed this video and we're going to leave all the links to this property below um, as well as contact information if you're interested in coming and staying. But anyways, thanks so much for watching and we will see you in our next video. Cheers. <laughs>